Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video today. We're playing I'll I'll wait, I'm playing our new uh I'm playing the Gala region in Sword and Shield, but this time we are actually doing we like we're doing a Nuzlocke. If you don't know what Nuzlocke's are, they're like once you you have to nickname your Pokemon and like once your Pokemon dies you actually have to say goodbye to it. That's really sad. So this so this is the intro for the game. So you guys I'll give you some time to read it. You guys can post a video if you don't have enough time. So this is the intro of, of the Gala region. So... Yes, Pokemon are on us in the sea and in the sky. And even with us in the, our towns. Okay. Dude, this guy has lots of Pokeballs. Be called Pokemon traders. Okay. Okay, we're gonna get ready. So this video might be a quick video since today video I actually um, want to start. I want you guys to choose my starter Pokemon. So like, write down in the comments what starter Pokemon you want. I'm just gonna show you the intro and all three starter Pokemon. If you guys have no idea what they look like, because some of you you might not even know Sword and Shield, but you do. Got, you guys obviously know Pokemon. I always how you're watching this video. Okay, so that's one of the gym leaders. There's lots of different types of just gym leaders in the game. There's like about six or eight. Oh wait, what? Is it a Dynamax? Really? Oh my god! I didn't know that was gonna happen. I, I think I don't know. I don't remember the intro. Pokemon Shield! Okay, let's get ready. That's an interesting intro. Okay, so that's Wulu. So we're gonna go a little bit of the walkthrough. I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of it. And once we get to the starter, starter's point, that's when we'll be recording. That's when we'll stop recording. I just wanna show you what starters we have. So it might take a little bit of time. Yep, there's myself. Wait, what? Where's my hat? Is that? is that a phone? Is that okay, that's definitely a phone. Hello, hello. Oh that your that your new your flash new phone than Pokemon. <laughs> I thought that was not too bad. Were, were you watching Lee's expedition match on it? But you can't cheer him on with your hands full. You know the only way to properly cheer on Lee would be his to be, would be with his famous Charizard pose. Oh, I know it, you have to like spin it around if you want to do it. Hop didn't, Hop didn't expect to see you here today. Dude, isn't this a big day? Like the big day. Yeah, never mind watching the match now. I've got it recording at home anyway. I'll, I record all my brother's matches. Wow, wonder how he does that. Come with me, Sam Pokemon. He should be here in any minute. And Lee always brings presents with when, oh, brings presents when he visits. So I, I wouldn't forget that bag if I were you. Good point, actually. No, I've got to run. See you at my, at mine later. Okay. Okay. Oh, hey, Munchlax. That's a Munchlax, just to say. Not a Snorlax. Just to make sure. That uh, you guys know your Pokemon. Wait, what? Oh, that's my bag. Wait, what? My dad's old bag. Wait, what? What did he look like in the game? I actually want to know what he looks like. I wonder if Pokemon will add that. I'm actually really interested. Open the X1. Oh, wait, I already know all of this. I already played the game before. Thanks for the guide. Okay, what? Will she have to say? Oh, I don't. Okay, so this is, oh, that's my Nintendo. Wait, let me check if there's like anything I can do to interact with anything that's good. It seems like not, so, better, Hop is waiting for you, better head, out, uh, head outside. Okay, that's how, so soon we're gonna be meeting the starters and you guys will be able to vote in, your, in the comments to see which starters you want me to get. In my old game, I chose Skull Bunny since I thought that was the cutest out of them. But it is a Nuzlocke. 
Haha, ha, have a look at you, Stan Pokemon. That old bag looks like it could pull you over. At least we know that it should hold anything we might bring. In, even if it's as big as a Snorlax. It's not true. Look, it's like a gigantic circle. Oh my god, look, a Wooly! But what is it doing here? Wow. I used to think that's hot, Wooly. Hey, you silly Wooly. I see what you're up to. Don't go to, go use some tackle on the fencing. Now you listen, now you're going past that fence. No. Everyone knows there are scary Pokemon living in the slumbering world. Meh. Now that, how about it, Sam Pokemon fan? Let's race. Bet I can make it to my house first. What with, what with you lugging about the big old bag? Oh my God, I don't have a big old bag. What kind I do? It looks pretty old actually. Okay, wait, let me ask Steve to Okay, something we really wanna know right now. Okay, so where, do I have to go to the house or what? Yep, we have to go to his house, okay. Okay, there's Hop. That's Hop, Mum. Mum, he, is he here? There you are at last. Oh, I brought a long stamp. Oh, and hello, dear. Yeah, yeah, but where's Lee? Have you got him crammed in a cupboard? He's not here yet. For the hundredth time, honestly, Hop, you must learn some patience. He's probably only only just arrived at the station and we're just... Then that's where I'm going. You know, Lee is helpless with direction. <laughs> I'll make sure he doesn't get lost on the way. Oh, will you? Yes, that probably is for the best. Okay. I'll wait for you on the route. Okay, let's see. What? Oh. oh, wait, what? How did the wool disappear that fast? Let's get a move on. Only remember some Pokemon. Wild Pokemon could come out of nowhere. You walk through patches of tall grass. I've got my wool with me, so I'm ready for battles against wild Pokemon, of course, but not you. So we'll, we'll still clear off well, as we go. Wait, what? What happens if you go in the grass? I wanna try. So there's grass. Don't, no one didn't do that. Nope. Oh, come on. He's just gonna say that. Really? That sucks. I really actually wanna get that Pokeball over there. Hey, Lee. Okay, there's Leon. And his chariot, obviously. Oh my God, this guy's showing off so much. Okay. Bro, does he even realize me? Staring at him. Hello, hello, we're just your champion Lee on his back. I promise I'll keep doing my best to deliver the greatest battles for you all to watch. It's our unbeatable champion, Leon. You and Charizard are the greatest. Well, thank you for that. I hope you, you're all carrying, car wait, what? I'm training up the Pokemon and never shy from battle. Then come challenge me for the champion title. Well, on it, we've all been working on our battle skills, just like you taught us to, Lee. But that Charizard of yours is too strong for the likes of us to take on. Too true that Charizard is really strong, but other Pokemon can be strong as well. That's why I want the strongest of challenges to fill the gym challenge and come battle me. My wish is for Galatrice to work together and become the strongest in all worlds. Hurrah. Lee. Hop. So many number, number one fan in all the world has come out this way to pick me up. Look at you, Hop. I reckon you've grown exactly an inch and a quarter since the last time I saw you. Bingo, that's sort of sharp eye that, that's kept you undefeated for so long, Lee. And these bright eyes over here. I've got it. You must be Stan Pokemon. <laughs> Am I right? I've heard loads about your 
news from my little brother. I'm the Galar region's greatest ever Pokemon champion and a massive Charizard fan too. Really? No wonder he got Charizard. Pe people call me the unbeatable Leon. Come on Lee and you stand Pokemon. Then I can beat the both of you back home. That hop always wanted to be the best, isn't he? With a proper rival of his own, I bet he'd push himself to become something truly special. Everyone, I bid you farewell for today, but don't you fret. I'll always be around to make sure everyone in the gala, in, a, in gala can have a champion time. Okay, let's go. Oh my God, they just run off without me? That mean. Okay. Come on, Lee, you promised us a present. So out with it. You brought some of me at Pokemon. You did, didn't you? I know you must have. Right then, the greatest gift from the greatest champion. <laughs> it's showtime, everyone. Okay. Okay, it's loading. Let's see all three of those. Take a good look at you two. Group, the grass type Pokemon Grookey. The fire type Pokemon Skull Bunny. The water type Pokemon Sobble. My favorite is Skull Bunny, but since this is a Nuzlocke, I actually kind of want to do a random Pokemon. A fan choice. So that's Skull Bunny. That's Sobble. And that's Grookey. And he's smashing a berry. Oh my God. Oopsies. Wow, Sobble cries a lot. <laughs> okay. All right, line up everyone. Oh my God, these things. I, I love school body design. I have a really big smile. Go on, you pick you pick first. I've already got my woolly after all. Okay guys, this is where you guys come through. Which one do you want me to choose? The water type Pokemon I does do anything. I show you that's what I'm going with. No, okay, no way, actually not. <laughs> Okay, so this one is Sobble. It's a water type. This one is Fire, Skull Bunny. This one is Grookey. And if you're wondering who I chose for my normal gen, not the Nuzlocke, it, it was Skull Bunny. So you guys can choose. And uh, I'm gonna do a next video on maybe like Saturday or Sunday, like, so like next week. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. And, and please vote your favorite or which one you would like me to choose and, will, and i'll see who's got the most vote whoever's got the most vote i will do a next video and i'll choose the starter so thank you guys for watching hope you enjoyed this video and also before you, i before this video ends remember to smash that like button so i know you like these pokemon nuts this the pokemon videos i do so far and also hit the subscribe button and put on notifications. So see ya.